New at five, conditions at military barracks have been called deplorable with one facility labeled uninhabitable. A government watchdog agency brought those unfortunate facts to light last fall. But that study only looked at facilities within the domestic U.S. Now lawmakers are demanding answers about barracks that are overseas. Mike Gooding has details. As of last September, the U.S. military had 168,000 active duty troops stationed overseas, according to the nonprofit initiative USA Facts. Now lawmakers want to learn about what kind of living conditions those troops face. The Bipartisan Foreign Overseas Residents Conditions Enhancement or FORCE Act would direct the Defense Department to examine the conditions of unaccompanied housing around the world. The bill was introduced this week by two House Armed Services Committee members, including Virginia Representative Jen Kiggins. Bases overseas don't have representatives who represent them in Congress that can speak for them and advocate on their behalf. The measure comes on the heels of a scathing report from the Government Accountability Office last September, which focused on barracks at 10 bases within the U.S. The GAO found problems which pose potentially serious health and safety risks, such as sewage overflow, mold and mildew, roaches and bed bugs, non-functioning heating and air conditioning, broken windows and locks, and non-working hot water. So we have some work to do, and Congress needs to put their money where their mouth is and make sure that we're prioritizing housing, which is a quality of life issue. The top 10 countries in which troops are based outside the U.S. in order are Japan, Germany, South Korea, Italy, the United Kingdom, Bahrain, Spain, Australia, Turkey, and Belgium. Mike Gooding, 13 News Now.